For two decades, a not-for-profit organization has dedicated time and resources to cleaning up the coastline of College Point, Queens. In celebration of Earth Day, the group wants to restore Big Rock Beach to its former glory. CBS2 is going to be part of this project and help. Our Vanessa Murdoch highlights Coastal Preservation Network in this month's Better Together Project Green. Plastic bottles, wrappers, foam, old tires, and other unidentifiable debris clutters Big Rock Beach. There's a rusted out rig, too. It's heartbreaking to see all the trash and the plastic all the time because it really looks like nobody cares. Lifelong College Point resident Jim Clevin reflects on his childhood when this beach was the place to be in summer and this Big Rock the main attraction. Everybody in the neighborhood will want to have their photograph posing on the rock. He would jump off Big Rock and enjoy the cool waters of Flushing Bay. The glory days seem long gone for the beach that boasts a beautiful view of LaGuardia and we're told unparalleled sunsets. But Coastal Preservation Network has big plans to bring it back. It's really going to be a jewel for this town. President Catherine Servino tells us last month they removed a deck barge, paid to have it cut up and hauled away. Volunteers secured the stairs to boost access to. When you look at the beach, it still looks polluted, but you can really see the potential for it now. The next cleanup here at Big Rock Beach is scheduled for Saturday, April the 30th. CBS 2 News will be here to help Coastal Preservation Network get the job done. We will be working together to um, get dirty, get our hands dirty, you know, and fill up lots of bags of trash, fill up a dumpster. Get this beach back in summer shape and offer this reef a better chance at survival. Senior scientist Dr. James Servino says reefs prevent shoreline erosion, clean the water. And they're sucking up CO2 like little vacuum cleaners. But not when this happens. Look at this, this foam and sort of these plastics that are clogging the intestinal tracts of these, of these shellfish. One muscle sucked a part of a toothbrush. Not at all what should be happening along our shores. Everybody should come out and volunteer, I think. Volunteer Miriana Karsik describes the challenge to keep College Point shorelines clean as constant. But the end result, a big rock beach kids can again enjoy worth every bag of trash removed. From College Point, Queens, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. And Dr. Servino says some of the trash on the beach comes from East River garbage barges, but the biggest issue remains to be illegal dumping. Throughout the years, CBS 2 News will be highlighting local organizations who are positively impacting our environment as part of our Better Together Project Green initiative. Better Together, that's we're all in this together. For more information on how you can help, head to our website, cbsnewyork.com. Can't wait to see that beach come back. Oh, to man. It's going to be great. So different, so positive. Absolutely.